Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's case, I'm going to be talking to you about is Neil Nortrop. So Neil was age 32 when he went missing from London. Missing since 12th of the 6th, 2003. A man and a woman have been arrested in connection with the death of a Devon fisherman, last seen in 2003. The 42 year old man was arrested on suspicion of a murder of the 34 year old Neil McArthland from Brixham. A 68 year old woman was arrested on suspicion of assisting a offender. Devon and Cornwall police said the pair both from Greenwich in South London were arrested in the capital and then questioned at a police station there before being released on bail. The missing man, also known as Neil Nortrop, was arrested in a capital and questioned at a police station there before being released on bail. The missing man, also known as Neil Nortrop, was reported missing from home in um, October 2003, although he had not been seen since June that year. Police and his family made very extensive inquiries about the father of two, including a poster campaign at the time of his disappearance. Police are still appealing for anyone who may have seen Mr. McArthland, Mr. Northrop, since June 2003, to please get in contact. The police said it is known that he was driving a blue Ford Mondeo registration plate W568XBD. Police are also interested in tracing the vehicle. His heartbroken mum had been appealing for information on his son's disappearance for quite some time. He vanished whilst visiting a friend in Greenwich and Dartford. His body has never been found. His mother Pam Northrop from Brixham in Cornwall said that her son left on 10th of June 2003 and last heard from him in a phone call the following day. The police said that they come up with um, a phone call on early June the 12th and Mrs Northrop said she has been increasingly reclusive since her son then had disappeared but cannot bring herself to move in case he turns up one day. She said, quote, the worst thing of it all is not knowing where he is, if he's not alive. I need to know where his body is so that he can be laid to rest properly. I can't believe he's definitely dead. I still got that tiny bit of hope. Seven years might be significant. Anniversary, but it's with me every single day of the year. He was a fisherman, bodybuilder, and also a Thai boxer. He was five foot eleven. Muscular build, crop fair hair, blue eyes, and also had diamond studs on his teeth. When he was last seen, he had been wearing a gold chain and drove a dark blue Ford Mondeo car. If anyone has any information, to please contact the number 0500 700 700. This is a tarot. Um, reading on Neil Nortrop and some TV reading I'm going to be doing. What happened to Neil Nortrop? Okay, so there was some deceit, there was lies, trickery, cheating, theft, Risky or dangerous behaviour, enemy, masquerading as a friend, spying, someone trying to make a break for it. Or Neil trying making a break for it. 
there was lack of money, uh, poor financial control, lack of opportunities or lost opportunities. There was some addiction, depression, mental health issues, secrecies, obsessions, cheating, dependencies, um, sexuality, powerlessness, hopelessness, abuse, violence or an assault that may have happened. Okay, so there may have been some forcefulness, lack of direction, lack of self-control, powerlessness, aggression or coercion. There was some form of peaceful resolution, moving on, a compromise, communication, um, or ending of a conflict. There was some um, charity or giving money. Um, there may be been some support, employment, assistance. Um, wealth, power, authority. He was trying to escape, escape a situation, trying to pull oneself together, learning from the past. There was some form of justice, um, consequences, a legal dispute, law, truth. Honesty, cause and effect, or there was a life lesson. There was to have some hope, um, contentment, renewal, healing, possibly spirituality. There was some secret um, anxieties, fears, insecurities, and deception. Okay. Who was involved in the disappearance of Neil Northcott? Someone that was could have been a female that was overly critic, pessimistic, rude, a gossiper, malicious. Male that may have been rude, bully. A dictator, impulsive or abusive. So it may have been, could have been a female and two males involved, or one male. So it could have been a male and a female involved here. Someone that may have been a wealthy businessman that had some form of nice status. Someone tried bringing balance to a situation. There was um, transferring money, juggling money. There was a lot of ups and downs. Trying to bring a balance to a situation. There was unexpected change, could have been involvement to a bankruptcy, financial disaster, or huge loss. <clears throat> there was an ongoing battle. Someone that had um, been close, may have been close to succeeding something here. There's stress, anxiety and fears, trying to um, recuperate, trying to find some peace and quiet. There was a male that was very arrogant, very reckless and show off. Okay. Someone felt trapped or restricted, um, may have been victimised, anxiety, feeling a lot of pressure, hopelessness, helplessness and being silenced. There was loneliness, paranoia, 
isolation, reclusiveness, withdrawal, antisocialness, and restrictions. Someone had a lot of options and choices. Um, there was opportunities, trying to pick and choose the situation. There may have been hallucinogenics that add involvement in you as well. Okay, where is Neil Northrop? Okay, so we see it is a new job or self-employment or trading, trying to build some type of reputation. It may have been con uh, commitment or hard work involved, being dedicated to something or someone. There's happiness, positivity, success and abundance. Okay, so there's fear of change, being indecisive and restricted options. There's um, happy family, um, possibly a reunion, a marriage, relationship, stability or security. Okay, what is the final outcome to be for Neil Northrop's case? Okay, so there is finding out about either a new relationship, a new romance, or a new beginning. Um, happiness, joy, possibly a pregnancy or celebration. There's also um, some happy families and a reunion. Um, a possibility of coming home. Because I've seen there's a lot of surprise here. The celebration here and there's specific... Um, events here where there's family coming together, the communities coming together, and there is some um, teamwork. But there is to be some delays, um, postponements, and some truths and lies being exposed. I feel like someone feels a lot of betrayal, um, some heartache, some sadness here. Okay, let's do the um, tea leaf reading cards. So what is very specific in the area where Neil Northrop is located? So these can be signs, symbols, letters and things like that within the area that's very, very specific. Okay. So we have a letter A for in the area name. So Apple, Archway, an Arrow and an Aeroplane. Triangle, money involvements, letter H, hammer, hand, hair, rabbit, um, and a hat, letter J, jug and jewels. Letter M, so he's with a man. Um, there's mask, mountain, mouse and mushrooms. Letter C, so a chain, church, clouds or clover. W, a body of water, a web, wheel, and a whale. Then we have a cross and a circle. 
letter D. So there's a door, dragon, a duck and a dove. Letter L, a ladder, a lamp or street light, leaves and a lighthouse. <clears throat> okay, a gambling place. Let us see if cow, crab, crown or crown and cross. Animals. Letter B. Um, a boat, bouquet of flowers, a tree branch and a bridge. Letter S. So a saw, scales, scissors. Snake, sharp and sheep. Astrology symbols. Letter S. Shell, ship, spider, spoon and star. Geometric shapes. Letter A, an altar, an ape, or an axe. Birds. Numbers and letters. And that's that. So these are signs, symbols, letters, um, things that's very, very specific in the area where Neil is located okay then so that is the case of neil nortrop until next time take care bye bye